Hi guys, G Economics here once again, and this is my next video in the Lessons Learned series for those of you studying GCSE Economics, the OCR syllabus. So, this is my six step guide to ensuring that you achieve full marks. Number one, stem with the question and whether it is or it is not important. I'll explain that a bit further in a moment. If such and such happens, the effect will be explained. Point number three, this happens because. Number four, whether this happens depends upon. Number five, repeat steps one to four on two further occasions just to go a belt and braces approach to your answer. And then number six, a conclusion and a judgment. So now let me just move this down slightly and I'll show you the answer to a question which was on a recent exam paper. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the question is, evaluate the effects of a rise in the cost of fuel on the production of cars. Six marks. So, first thing to do is to say whether or not this would be important. So, rising fuel costs have important implications for car producers or the production of cars. Point number two, say why and what happens. If the cost of fuel rises, the petrol retailer will increase the forecourt price and hence the price to the consumer will increase. This happens because the petrol retailer does not want to bear the burden of that cost increase themselves. Demand will in theory fall and hence fewer cars will need to be produced. Point number five, so the weather and this depends upon, in reality the demand for petrol is price inelastic and therefore unlikely to change even if price rises. Hence car production may not in fact fall. And then you repeat that process on two further occasions. I will not go through all the points, so the two further points, but I will quickly jump to the judgment and you can read the points in between at your leisure, ladies and gentlemen. So here we have the final point to conclude Rising fuel costs have had little stroke, no impact on the demand for fuel. Other factors, such as Brexit uncertainty, are clearly much more important for car manufacturers. And you'd have to say that we've seen that here in the UK as manufacturers have either scaled back production or closed certain production lines. We've certainly seen that at the local Nissan plant here in Sunderland in the northeast. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'll leave that with you. Bye for now.